We're up north for today's game in Green Bay, Wisconsin. We're nearing the midpoint of the season, and it's been a great year so far. It looks like that trend will continue today. Each of these teams hoping to gain momentum as the Washington Redskins come into town to face the Green Bay Packers. I'm Al Michaels with my partner John Madden here to bring you today's game. That quarterback's not going to have an easy game. He's going to have this guy chasing after him the whole time. He's all. You have called tails. Is that correct? Green Bay has won the toss and chooses to receive. Both teams eager to get today's action started, so let's go to the field. Conway looks like he's just about ready to kick this one off. He sends this one toward the end zone. He receives the kick and starts upfield. The Packers take over on offense at the 26-yard line. The Redskins have an injured linebacker, and he won't play at all in this one. They're going to be very careful because obviously any injury to the head is very serious, so they're going to bring him back very slowly. Far gives the ball off. About seven yards there. Second down and three to go. The Packers are in the offset eye formation. Green tucks it away. Breaks three of the defenders. The 40, the 30, the 20, the 10. And he's in for the touchdown. An incredible run to get him into the end zone. Yeah, he knew where he wanted to go. And he got there. The kick is up. The extra point attempt is good. And so they turn that drive into a great one as it ends with a touchdown. I think the whole team's happy after that one. They're probably telling their defense to give them the ball back so they can go score again. And with that score, they're up by a touchdown. He gets the kick away. Number 85 returns his kick. This is where you want to be able to respond. You also don't want to panic because it's only the first quarter. First and ten. Ball on their own 22. Four linemen and three linebackers lined up defensively. Davis looking for a seam on the carry. Nickerson pulls him down at the 25-yard line. It's second down and seven to go. Ball on their own 25. Six-yard line. Number 18, under center. Dropping back. Looking for a receiver. With the pass, he hits his receiver. Good job of bringing the pass in. This guy can really move. He turns things up two or three notches when it really counts. That's the kind of thing you love to see as a coach. Guys who have that second and third gear. Four linemen and three linebackers lined up defensively. Looking downfield. Throws over to his right. Gardner was the intended target on that pass attempt. Number 18 couldn't get it to his man. I wonder if that one slipped out of his hand. It was clearly off target. It's second down and 10 to go. Back to pass. Steps up into the pocket. Throws over to his right. And the defender brings him down at the 34-yard line. And they find themselves in scoring range. 
fifth play of this drive. The Redskins use motion. Looking to turn it upfield. And the defender brings him down at the 33-yard line. He was dropped before he could get back to the line. Yeah, you can't run without good blocking. Fourth down coming up, and they need about two. Four-man front this time. They'll go with a pass. He's looking with a throw. It was tipped. So the defense comes up big on a very interesting decision to go for here in the first half. Yeah, you really have to question the decision-making here. You're saying that you're not going to trust your special team, but now you put all the pressure on your defense. Looking downfield. Looking downfield. Far. Rolls right. Deep pass. Shade makes the stop at the 31. The quarterback did a really good job finding his pocket with that pass. This receiver can really do it all. He has speed, runs great routes, and he can make catches on any kind of throw. Because he's got those great hands. Green receives the handle. And he stopped at the 29-yard line. He might have gotten a yard or two. That guy got knocked around by that defense. He needs a little protection from his lineman. Second and eight coming up here. Ball on the 29-yard line. That far with four options at receiver. Dropping back, he surveys the field with the pass. Hits his man with the pass. He put everything he had behind that throw. That's one way to make sure your receiver doesn't drop the ball. You throw it so hard that he has to catch it in self-defense. You just put it right on him. It's first and goal. Ball on the one. Looking for an open. And he stopped at the one-yard line. He went nowhere, John. Went nowhere fast. So it's second and goal. Ball one inch out. The quarterback gets dragged down. He tried to turn it upfield, but didn't have much luck there, John. Yeah, but the defense stayed at home on that play, and they stopped him before he could go too far. So now we have third and goal. Ball one foot away. Everybody on the run. On the run. And he stopped at the three. Lost about two yards. three yards. Longwell is looking to add to their total with this attempt. And it's on its way. The try is good. And they're able to get some points out of the drive with a successful field goal. Yeah, I know they might have liked to have gotten in there for a touchdown. But three points is three points. And sometimes that's all you need. He sends it off. Number 85. Feels it cleanly. The Redskins will start this drive from 23. So they have first and 10 here. Quick drop. Throwing short. Davis just couldn't find a way to come up with that. Number 18 saw the pressure coming on that play. And that's a right decision in that case. Get rid of the ball and take the incomplete. He's looking to pass. Gets the pass off. Russell couldn't make the catch. Incomplete. That pass might have been thrown a little too hard. If he throws it any harder, the skin might come off the ball. Number 18, under center. Back to pass. Surveying the field. Passing to his right. Knocked down. Nickerson got his hand in there to knock it down. One thing remains constant. No matter what kind of quarterback you are, rushing your throws is going to end up in incompletion or worse. Fourth and ten. Ball on their own 23. Barker is just about ready to punch this one away. Number 82 will be looking for some good blocking on the run back. 
They've turned their last possession into three points. Let's see what they do with the ball this time around. The teams has switch sides, and we'll start the second quarter. It's first and ten. Ball on their own 45. Far directing traffic. Looking to throw. Looking for an option. Throws it. And he can't find a way to keep his edge. He couldn't hang on. You need really no excuse for that. You just have to catch those balls. Second and ten. Ball on their own 45. Four man front this time. Looking for an opening. And he stopped at the 47 yard line. This is what you want to get from your running game. If he can keep this up, he'll end up with a career day. Ball right around midfield. Four linemen and three linebackers lined up defensively. Rolling left. Long throw. And he can't hang on. So the pass goes incomplete in the end zone. Russell looks like he's ready for the return. Russell signals fair catch on this punt. On their last drive, it was three plays and out, and now the offense can down onto the field once again. Deep in their own territory. Four linemen and three linebackers lined up defensively. On the carry. He can't pass them up. Sharper stops him at the 15-yard line. Davis trying to find some room on that carry. Yeah, it sure looks like this guy's going to be involved in the offense today. The quarterback gets set with only one back behind him. Surveying the field. He goes to the left side. And he's brought down at the 21. He never hesitated on that pass. That was quite a throw. This guy's been blessed with a golden arm. Less than a yard to go. Ball on their own 21. Number 18 sets up. Can't bring him down. Wayne records the stop at the 25-yard line. Davis finds some room up the middle and gets the first. That's some good stuff right there. You give it to your back, have a ball straight ahead for good yardage, and you get a new set of downs to work with. Receives the toss. Butler makes the tackle at the 31. Nickerson takes him down at the 36-yard line. First and ten. Four linemen and three linebackers lined up defensively. On the carry. Takes this one outside. Pick up of about eight. 36 for a gain of eight yards. Second and two. Ball on their own 44. Looking to throw. Throws it out over to the left. It's broken up. He took a big chance on that pass. That guy has a great arm. Sometimes he takes some chances and he throws in the cover. Two yards to go. Let's it go. Still running. McKenzie takes him down at the 45-yard line. Fourth and maybe one. Ball on their own 45. Parker is looking for a good punt here. He's waving for the fair catch. Number 82. Saw them closing in fast, so he signaled for the fair catch. He did the right thing. Concentrated and caught the ball. It's first and ten. Ball on their own 22. 
He's looking to pass. Looking for a receiver. Rolling out to his right. Deep pass. Green pulls him down at the 47 yard line. situation like this. The only difference is this isn't the scout team defense. Far gives the ball off. Number 57 brings him down at the 39-yard line. I'm sure they'll be going to the air as long as they have the ball. Right. Second and seven coming up here. Ball on the 39-yard line. They'll go from the eye formation. Dropping back. He surveys the field. Throws it. And they're able to connect on that one. And so he was able to fire that one to his receiver, converting for a first down. That guy's always had a great arm. That's something you can't teach. Being in range like this, they probably want to conserve some time so they can get a score. They don't want to let the other guys have much time to do anything. Far directing traffic. Drops back. He surveys the field. Gets the pass off. Glenn was the intended target on that pass attempt. Second and ten. Dropping back. Looking for a receiver. Rolls left. Gets his hand on it. He makes a great play by breaking the pass. You know, the quarterback needs to put that ball in a position where the defender can't get to it. That didn't happen there. Third down and a long coming up here. Ball on the 30-yard line. The Packers line up in the shotgun. Looking to throw. He's looking. Looking to the middle. He hits his receiver. Green makes the tackle at the 25-yard line. Try to come through with the field goal here. And it's up. Splits the uprights and good. He kicks it off. Number 85. We'll try to bring this one back. They're just about ready to get this drive started after being forced to punt on their last possession. It's first and ten. Ball on their own 17. They'll go from the I formation. Man in motion. Davis cuts it away. Lane records the tackle at the 19-yard line. They'll have to move the ball downfield quickly through the air to try to score before the half. And it looks like an offset on. He's going to throw. Passing to his right. Loses the defender. He's out to the 30. And he stopped at the 33-yard line. So they have first and ten here. Ball on their own 33. They line up in the I formation. Back to pass. Number 18. Rolls out to his right. It's broken up. He knocked that one down. He was in a great position to make that play. Second and ten. Ball on their own 33. Surveys the field, passes it, locked it. The intended receiver, Williams, knocked that one down. The receiver just didn't have good position on it. 
This is where the defense needs to just play smart and not give up a big play. There's not a whole lot of time left, so they just need to prevent them from getting into field goal range. The Redskins line up with three wide receivers. He's going to throw. Looking downfield, passes it. He hits his receiver. And it looks like they'll mark it at the 39-yard line. I don't think they can do much more than just throw one long. So I'm sure the defensive coach is telling his guys, don't get beat deep. Let's check in with Melissa. Well, Al, it doesn't look good. I spoke to the team doctor, and he indicated that it's the type of injury that will take some time to heal. They're hopeful that he won't be out long, but his return is out. Melissa, thanks for the update. And obviously, we're very happy that it's not that serious. So it's second and ten. Ball on the 39-yard line. Sixth play of this drive. Back to pass. Passing to his right. Knocked away. It's the end of the second quarter. We'll go back to the play on the field. So, halftime now over. Let's take a look at how both teams performed in the first half. Long well. Looks like he's just about ready to kick this one off. He sends this one toward the end zone. Russell fields it cleanly. The Redskins take over on offense at the 20. So, they have first and 10 here. Ball on their own 20. Pulls him down at the 23-yard line. He's starting to make his presence felt out there. It's second down and seven to go. Four-man front this time. Puts on the juke. Davis was dropped behind the line. And if you want to talk about the most effective way to stop the run, it's playing on the other side of the ball. When you get penetration like that, it's very hard for the offense to get positive yardage. Gardner in motion. Quick drop. Passing right. And he finds the open man. Great reception on that play, John. Looks like someone might have blown their coverage on that one. First and ten. Number 18 sets up. Number 89, the motion man. Looking to turn it on field. Davis runs up the middle. And he stopped at midfield. They keep pounding the run like this. And the other team is going to have to ask for some extra oxygen on the sideline. Looking for blocker. Looking for room. Butler makes the tackle at the 45. He contributes a first down, doing a good job of turning the corner on that play. Usually on runs like that to the outside, it's a receiver and a tight end who makes a good block to get you those yards. Looking to turn it up field. Sharper wraps him up and now has four tackles. They went back to the run on that play. That just goes to show you that the coach trusts the guy to hang on to the ball. Number 18 sets up. Looking to throw. Steps up into the pocket. Russell couldn't make the catch. Williams makes a great play by breaking that pass up. Right, nothing fancy there. Don't even give the receiver a chance. Just knock it down. The bats are lined up in an eye. Looking for room. Slips the tackle. Butler laid a good hit on him there for his fifth tackle of the game. He tried to find a hole and just got what he could. Yeah, he tried to stretch it outside. But the defense was quick to react to the play. And even quicker to move off their blocks and get in a position to cover the hole. Four linemen and three linebackers lined up defensively. 
Only one man back. The Redskins using motion. He's looking to pass. Short pass. He hits his receiver. Number 45. It's not short of the marker on that play. I don't know why the receiver would break off that route and make the catch short of the first down. Maybe he thought that he'd be able to do more with it after he caught it. Conway and the kicking team come on for this field goal attempt. The kick is up. The field goal attempt is good. So the drive ends not with a touchdown, but with a field goal. And the coaches, while no doubt happy for the three, will have to take a look at how to push it down the field all the way the next time for a touchdown. Hey, that's why you have your kicker. You put him in position to come through, and when he does, it gives your offense confidence. But they don't have to do it all. They on him to get points too. Greenberg is starting to pull away. So they have first and ten here. The quarterback is back in the shotgun. Drops back. Looking for a receiver. Throw it. Nice connection. And he's ridden out at the 47. Number 82 makes the catch. His first of the day. First and ten. See something in the defense. He's looking up field. And the defender brings him down at the 46. Five-yard game. A little over four to go. Ball on the 46-yard line. So we've reached the end of the third quarter with the Green Bay Packers ahead of the Washington Redskins. 13. Three. About four to go. Ball on the 46-yard line. Looks like he's calling an audible. Drops back. He surveys the field. Rolling out to his left. He hits his receiver. Loose ball. The Redskins grab the wide ball. Great play by the defense to recover the fumble. Yeah, they were right there to jump on the ball. First and ten. Ball on their own 41. Number 18 with a man in motion. Back to pass. With the pass, he hits his receiver. The receiver found a hole in the secondary, and the quarterback found him with the pass. The defense could never let up out there. This guy could make some incredible catches. Quick drop. Rolls right with the pass. Gardner, the intended receiver. He couldn't bring that pass in. Yeah, and the receiver dropped it. He was either thinking about the hit that was coming or the run after the pass. But you have to think about the catch first. Number 18, under center. He's going to throw. With the pass, Gardner just couldn't find a way to come up with that. He threw the ball into pretty heavy coverage. He's really pushing his luck with a pass like that. Third and ten. 
The Redskins use motion. They'll go with a pass. Makes the throw. Gets the pass off. He finds his man. He pulls the trigger quickly. As hard as he throws it, he always seems to put the ball right on the receiver's number. First down and goal to go. The quarterback gets set with only one back behind him. With the pass, nice completion. He tossed the ball to the receiver for the touchdown. That was a great pass by the quarterback. He delivered that ball where only his receiver could make the catch. And with that score, the momentum has shifted. And it's on its way. The extra point attempt is good. A good-looking drive, and they score the touchdown. And the offensive unit should be very pleased with their performance on that one. They did everything they had to on that one. And the end result is a trip across the goal line and a TD on the board. Number 32 is heading upfield. The defense needs to come up big with a stop here. And so they have first and ten here. Ball on their own 29. And it looks like an upset on. Green looking for a seam. Missed tackle. Bailey makes the tackle at the 37 yard line. to go. Ball on their own 37. Number nine will come into this game to punt. Russell looks this punt into his hands. Let's see if they can have the same sort of success on this possession that they had in their last, taking up a lot of yardage through the air on their way to a score. First and ten. The Redskins are in the offset eye formation. Looking downfield. Looking for a receiver. Passing right. No completion. Number 45. Drops it. That's the old rule. If you get your hands on it, you got to catch it. So it's second and ten. Ball on their own 32. Number 18 with a man in motion. Davis gets the toss. Showing good moves. And the defender brings him down at the 35. Third and seven. Ball on their own 35. Looks like a two tight end set this time. Passes it. Russell can't come up with it on that attempt. He just overthrew that one. That pass was clearly overthrown. Fourth down now. Seven yards to go. Number 82 lines up deep for the punt return. Number 82 waves for the fair catch. So the offense takes over. The last time they had the ball, they had a very tough time getting anything going. So they have first and ten here. Seven. Makes his fifth stop of the game on that play. About six to go. Five. 
Two-minute warning coming up. Dropping back, looking downfield. Far held onto the ball too long. <laughs> His ears are ringing after that hit. Third and 15. Nickel back in this time. Looking to throw. Looking for an option. Rolling right. Passing to the middle of the field. Picked off. He's inside the 10. Touchdown, Redskins. Bailey showed outstanding athletic ability by grabbing that one. The quarterback seemed to rush that one a little. Apparently, the official upstairs saw something, and he'll have the ref take a second look at this one. The call on the field is overturned. It was unclear initially why they called for a review, but now we understand the reason. Yeah, it's important to get the calls right at this point of the game. Fourth and 15. Ball on their own 25. Number nine will come into this game to punt. Russell, he's already looking upfield. The defense did a great job on the last series, forcing the offense to go three and out. The quarterback's going to be the guy making this thing happen. He should realize that there's still a lot of time left, knowing it's only a field goal they need. As long as he can move him down the field quickly and avoid third and long, they'll have a chance to at least tie this thing. Dropping back. Number 18. Let's it fly. He's lucky that one wasn't picked up. This guy's got to buckle down and make some better reads out there. One play down, three to go for this defense to stop this drive and get the win. Davis, the lone back. He's going to throw. Steps up. Passes left. Broken up. Lots of pressure, but he was able to get rid of it. Pressure can really mess up the timing of a play. That pass was incomplete because the quarterback had to get rid of it before he wanted to. Third and long. Ball on their own 37. They'll go with a pass. Throws over to his right. Gardner was the intended target on that pass attempt. Fourth and ten. Ball on their own 37. Number 18, under center. Man in motion. Dropping back. Throwing. And he makes the grab. A display of good concentration by the receiver. If he can make catches like that regularly, he can expect to see more passes thrown in his direction. Dropping back. Passing right. And this pass is complete. McKenzie with the stop at the 16-yard line. Down inside the 15. The quarterback lines up with two backs behind him. Surveying the field with the pass, and he ducks out of bounds at the 13. Now the defense has a chance to make something happen here. The offense is probably thinking touchdown now. So if I'm one of these defensive guys, I'm looking to step in front of one if they drop back to pass. Number 18, under center. Davis to the outside. Touchdown, Redskins. So they get in on the ground. Yeah, he was able to make some moves and make the defenders miss to get the yardage he needed. The Redskins find themselves up by a small margin. And it's up. The extra point attempt is good. The Redskins leading in the game, but not by much. Number 32 gets set to return the kickoff as we take a look at his stats. Conway looks like he's just about ready to kick this one off. He gets the kick away. Number 32 is on his way upfield. The last time the offense had the ball, they gave it away on an interception. Let's see what happens this time down the field. What they need here is some yards on first and second down so they don't set themselves up with third or possibly fourth and long. 
The whole field is open to him because there's a decent amount of time. Left. Looking downfield, rolls left, far with the throw. He should have caught that one. There's just no excuse for that. He's getting paid a lot of money to make those catches. You got to think they'll be going with something in the air here, conserving time while moving downfield for the score. Drop. He's looking, rolling out to his left, passes it. Walker was the intended target on that pass attempt. So they dug themselves into a hole here, a long third down situation. Ball on their own 27. With an extra DB, the defense is in the nickel. Looking to throw, looking downfield. Far lets it fly and caught a tremendous catch. And the defender brings him down at the 28. Face mask on the defense, number 31. Grabbed his face mask to bring him down. You know, there's so many limbs flying and body parts moving around that you just tackle whatever you can and you grab anything that's moving. Right. Sometimes you get a handful of masks. So they have first and 10 here. Ball on the 23 yard line. Nickelback in this time. Looking to pass. He surveys the field. Passing to his left. The defense has it. The defender is there to make the play. Throwing into coverage like that is like playing Russian roulette. Eventually, you're going to lose. I think their best bet here is to run it with a simple handoff. You just never know what could happen on the clock. David searching for a seam. Slips the tackle. And it looks like this one will be spotted at the 17. We're nearing the end here, and they figure to go with a running play to keep this clock winding down. They need seven. Looking for room. Sharper records the tackle at the 22-yard line. So he adds another tackle and now has six. And on this third down play, they'll most likely run the ball to take more time off the clock. Third and maybe two. Ball on their own 22. Davis looking for a seam with the carry. And it looks like they'll mark it at the 31-yard line. The only way the defense could get the ball back is if they had all their timeouts. The offense just has to kneel down a few times, and this one's over. It's first and ten. The gun signals the end of the game. The final score is Washington 17, Green Bay 13.